This yeah. video will cover preparing good quality artwork for your uh, screen prints. It's really important to have a good black and white copy uh, with nice solid blacks and a nice clean white background. Um, the blacks need to be solid so that they will block the light in the photo exposure process. This photocopy is too grey. The dots are printed out as quite a pale grey and so they will just appear on the um, finished screen if you were to expose this as just a kind of grey, mucky, unclear kind of spot. Here the background is way too grey, so it's grey all over. There's lots of grey noise in the background and that would result in a screen um, that just has a kind of mucky grey patch in the middle. So this one is too grey. This one, the dots are too light. But this one with the nice black dots is perfect. So another uh, thing that can happen when you're preparing your artwork is that you'll get a good quality black and white laser print or photocopy, but there'll be some kind of noise. You might have glued some pieces on, taken a photocopy and then found that there are little lines or where the shadows were where you glued, or there might have been some marks on the photocopy um, plate, the glass plate that have showed up on your artwork. These are pretty simple to remove. Uh, you can use whiteout and simply paint the white out or the liquid paper onto the artwork to get rid of those marks. But it's important that you then don't use that copy for your artwork to expose onto the screen because these white out areas will actually read as solid. So you do need to take another photocopy of that to get your final artwork. Now this one still has a few stray marks on it. And so one way to avoid going back up to the photocopier and getting another copy is to simply trim the marks out with a scalpel knife. Make sure that you've sharpened the blade before that you use the scalpel knife and you've got it extended in a safe position. Um, working onto a cutting mat or piece of box board, simply trim out the grey marks And so now that that's gone, it won't appear on our final screen. Um, so here we have a really good black and white copy. Um, I've got rid of a little bit of a mark there, so that won't appear. Um, it's got good contrast, good solid blacks, and we're ready to go.